spoil for choice. It's 4.07 in the morning and I am about to drive to Sydney to the airport to get on a plane to meet Phil for a week of adventures. So come along with us. See you at the airport. Self-check-in was okay. I... Um, did most of it before we came. So then I just printed out my own bag, luggage, tag, stuck to my bag. Probably on the wrong thing, but that's okay. You live and learn. Got through security really quickly. I've had breakfast. I'm finishing my coffee. And then I'm going to go and get some footage of my plane, hopefully, arriving before I board. I'm going to Perth. Did I tell you that? Pretty sure that's my plane, too. Still fairly quiet, but you know it'll fill up in a minute. Nothing like a takeoff. Flying over the blue mountain. We got to Hillary's and um, getting off the plane took probably 25 minutes because of the good to go pass where it needs to be checked. You need to do a temperature check at the um, gate and they were only letting 40 people off the plane at a time. So it took a little bit of time but it was faster than I thought. Luggage was there. The slowest thing was waiting for Phil to come with the car. Um, yeah, so we're now at Hillary's Boat Harbour and at Sorrento Keys and we'll show you around here. This used to be full of boats for sale. Looking to go to Rottnest for the day? That's your boat. Indian Ocean. Beaches on the east coast are on the Pacific Ocean. There's people out enjoying the 
autumn sunshine. It's beautiful today. It's about 25 degrees. Our noble steed. It's a brand new ASX. Not a lot of power, but it'll be great for a week. Got a bit of space. This is our view. That's the pool. This is the observation deck at the Rendezvous Grand Hotel on the 24th floor. Ekin said that the view would be pretty cool. Can you see those kites? How cool are they? There's lots of food trucks down on the foreshore. We're gonna go down there for dinner tonight and see what we can find. Scarborough Beach. The sun's setting over the Indian Ocean. You can see it all the way up the coast. Lots of activity. Food trucks everywhere. My goal for day one was to catch the sun setting into the Indian Ocean from Scarborough Beach. And that's what I'm gonna do, guys. Phil's wandering around to scope out the food fans. Glorious way to watch the day in. If you're enjoying this sunset, give it a like. Do you prefer sunsets or sunrise over the ocean? Let me know in the comments below. I'd love to hear. Day's end at the beautiful Scarborough Beach. The last glow of the day coming over the horizon. Oh wow, that is awesome. I know. You can taste them, you want to taste them. Sure are. Smells amazing. Mm -hmm. Curious. I thought it might be good dessert. We've still got to pick a bean. <laughs> There is so much to choose from, we're a little bit overwhelmed. What are you feeling like? I don't know. Didn't we see something down the Indian? Hey? Yeah. He has his Jamaican kitchen. Smoked meat. Look at these guys working hard. What do you think, Phil? Support for choice. What are we going? Indian street food. Okay. Indian street food. There is so much to choose from.
caramel better than your chocolate? No, I'll just have caramel, thank you. And I'll just have chocolate. Hey, can I have a ginger beer? Please. And dessert? We're going Brazilian Cheerio. What did you have? What's the difference? They're filled, not dipped. I've got caramel, filled on chocolate, and we're getting a drink. We didn't get one with you know which was amazing. So I just spoke to the information booth and these Thursday markets are a weekly thing through summer. They've been running all year or all summer and then they've got a couple of more weeks and they're having a couple of weeks break and they're going to start running a Saturday afternoon winter market with a fire pit and a um, where you can toast marshmallows and stuff. I think that's pretty cool. Um, but yeah. So if you're in WA, near Scarborough, on a Thursday in summer, or a Saturday in winter, come and check out this vibe. It's absolutely brilliant. We've still got more to come of our WA adventure. If you liked what you saw today, why not hit that like and subscribe button, ring that little bell so you'll be notified of our upcoming videos. As always, thanks for joining us. Travel brilliantly. Bye. If you liked what you saw, check out the video above or find us on social.